Hey guys, I'm Tracy Kane and welcome. This is my very first YouTube video. I'm a style expert. I used to work in the fashion industry with companies like Calvin Klein and Tommy Hilfiger and now I'm a mama of twins and I'm pursuing a career on TV and film. I've done many commercials and films. I've worked all over the country on morning news programs delivering fashion and beauty tips to moms and everyone else that tends to watch me. So this morning I thought I would bring to you some tips on how to dress up those yoga pants. You know, some mornings you get up and you have no thought on what you have. You don't even have time to think about what you're going to wear. So you just throw in your old yoga pants, throw in your old t-shirt, and then you don't feel so great about yourself. So today I have some ideas that you can spruce these up and then feel a little bit more put together. So if you do end up making it to the gym, great, you have your gym clothes on. But if you don't make it there, at least you looked pulled together and a little bit fashionable for those days you have to go to the book fair at school or grab coffee with a girlfriend or you have a quick business meeting. Just short and sweet and easy and out the door. So when you're putting your look together, you want to remember that small details make a large impact. Whether it's adding some jewelry, a lipstick that has a little bit more vibrancy to it, or some layering some pieces, adding a scarf, those are all gonna really make you look like you have a put together look. So remember, think about the little things that you can add that are going to make you look polished and put together. So the lipstick that I'm wearing today is by Stila, and the color is called Maya. And I lined it with Brownie Pink by Bobbi Brown. Obviously this is one of my favorite lip liners because it's itty bitty. It's a great neutral. Uh, but the lipstick, I feel that you should go a little bit darker, not super dark, but maybe a shade darker than what you would normally do with a gloss, especially if you're not going to wear that much other makeup. Maybe just add some mascara and a little bit of bronzer, but this is going to make your eyes pop out more and just make you look more put together. So the other thing I want to think about is jewelry. This is one of my favorite watches by Victorinox. It's actually a men's watch, but I like it because it's chunky and it's a little bit more casual than a fancy dressy watch. And one of my favorite bracelets that my husband gave me, and it has the serenity prayer on it. Always reminds me that just control the things that you can and don't worry about everything else that you can't. So it kind of puts you in a good mood for the day. After that, I worry about my layering pieces, whether it's a scarf, a denim jacket, a flannel shirt, and then think about your shoe options as well. So first I like to add a denim jacket. It's probably one of my favorite layering pieces because it kind of goes with everything. Really dresses things down, makes them casual, gives them a little bit more of a young feel. But I do like to roll the sleeves up. Don't ever walk around with your sleeves down. I kind of just tug the cuffs and pull them up over my elbows, gives it a little bit more attitude. And then I wrap something around my waist, whether it's a hoodie or a flannel shirt. Right now, flannel shirts, plaids are really in trend. So I'm kind of go with this one today. You just casually wrap this around, hide your butt. You know, if you're having a bad butt day, that's always a good thing. Because you know, I think no matter how small our butts are, we're always self-conscious about them, especially once you're a mom. And then either, you know, it's a little chilly, you could throw a, a um, scarf on, blanket scarves are huge this season, but I'm not going to choose this one today since I will be clashing my plaids. So we're gonna leave that one out. And you can either go with sneakers or if you have a meeting or you go to the kids' school, I tend to go with a boot. So these are from a couple years ago, but they're just great casual boots. They're really durable, go with everything. normally put a sock on but for now we're just gonna go without and then I like to bring a bag a handbag that kind of goes with the look you don't want to bring one of your dressier bags because it doesn't complete what you're going for more casual laid back remember you're looking for to be put together so I like a messenger bag and then your hands are free this is probably my favorite one by Hammett it's a handbag company out of LA. It has a nice quilted leather and some great studs. It has a really nice casual feel to it. So remember, the next time you're in that mood to just wear yoga pants, add a few small details, and it'll give you a whole completed look. And please, subscribe. I need your help. I need to know you guys are out there and watching. And send me some comments. Let me know what you thought of this first video. We'll see you next time.